Hi, I'm LaShawn and welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time here and you want to be inspired on a daily basis, then this is the perfect place for you. Start now by subscribing and clicking the bell. Hello, hello. My name is LaShawn and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is a very simple lifestyle vlog where I get here every morning and I try to uplift, encourage, and inspire as many people as I possibly can. Let me tell you a little bit about myself. I am the divorced mother of three adult children. I have two boys and a girl. I am a United States Navy veteran. I'm also a surgical tech. I am disabled and I work full time here now from my home. I am a hustler. That's right, I'm a hustler. I get up every day and I work. I do something for my YouTube channel every single day and I love what I do. I love to help people, uplift people, encourage people and talk about the love of the Lord. That's right. So this is my new intro. So here I am, <laughs> and if you like what you see, click like, share, comment, and come back here on a daily basis. So, here's today's video. Hello YouTube, it's me LaShawn, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm so glad you decided to join me here once again. Today is meal planning time. Uh, we are hustling, okay? Uh, grocery prices are through the roof. And we are all just trying to eat. We're doing our very best, trying desperately to eat on any given day. And so meal planning is important for this uh, uh, stretch that we're going through. It's a hard time for everybody, not just people on fixed income. As you know, I live on a fixed income and I have X amount of dollars to eat off of for one month. And I, you know, I do my very best to stretch it. And my goal is not to eat healthy. My goal is to eat, okay? And if I can eat healthy, I do. And a lot of people don't understand that. I'm trying to eat every day, okay? I, I do not have the money to get all fruits and vegetables and all my favorites, my strawberries, my cherries, and all those things And when I have to eat. Also, I don't have that kind of money. So I'm doing the best I can. So you can, you ain't even got to, you know, say it in the comment section. You don't have to be mean. You don't have to be rude. I'm doing the very best I can. Okay. That's my disclaimer. Okay. And all for you, all you negative people can roll out anyway. Okay. Now, if you're new to my channel, this is how I meal plan. All you need is a sale paper, wherever you're going to go to go to the grocery store. Here in Jacksonville, Florida, every Wednesday, we get sale papers and coupons in our mailbox. I look at the different sale papers and I decide which one I'm going to go with for that particular week. And then I uh, circle the items that I'm going to get. And then I take the sale paper to the grocery store and I only get what's on that list. It's the same thing as writing a list, except I'm visual. And so if I want Lay's potato chips, for example, but, you know, Lay's are not on sale, I'll get the, the bargain brand for that particular store. So I'll circle Lay's, but that don't mean I'm going to get the Lay's. But it will remind me that I have to get plain potato chips for my lunch. So that is just some of the things that I do. So it's not difficult. All you need to meal plan is your sale paper and a marker. And I love color markers. We're going with the orange for the day, YouTube. We're going for the orange positive patch. I love meal planning because I know how much money I got and I have to stretch it any way I can. Okay, let's get started. I know exactly what I need and uh, I've already been in my pantry. I've been in the fridge. I've been in the freezer and I've been in my cabinet. So I know exactly what I have to get in order to make it, in order to eat every day, okay? So right off the back, I can see uh, my dressing right there. I'm gonna go ahead and circle that. Obviously, that's wishbone, which is really expensive. Wishbone is very expensive uh, salad dressing, but I'm circling it because I'll get the brand, whatever brand is on sale, or the no name, it don't bother me. Now, they got the potatoes. I usually get a bag of potatoes, but I think I'm going to get wedges this time. 
I'm going to circle the potatoes. That's how I'm going to remember because I know they're not going to have the wedges here. I've been buying the pack of wedges instead of cutting up the potatoes because my hands and, and things like that, I don't want to get cut. All right. So they got bacon. Ugh, mm, mm, how much did that say? $13.98 a pack. Mm, mm, mm. That's a shame. That's a shame. No cabbage for me because I cook my cabbage a certain way and I use the bacon in mine. Now, I really want some pork chops, and um, we're going to look at these prices here. But I see a pack of chicken legs that are quite inexpensive. See, that's how you got to do it. You got to say, well, this is $15 a pack. Ooh, this is $2.99. You got to eat. Okay, so we're going to also circle this shredded cheese. I use shredded cheese for my tacos, my fajitas, my... Uh, macaroni. Uh, I haven't made wraps in a while either. Also, I see the chips. Now, as you know, when I make lunches, I use lunch meat. I make lunches and I put a couple of plain chips uh, on my uh, plate. And what is this? No, we're not going to get any of that. I don't need any canned goods. That's right, people. I don't need any canned goods. I just cleaned out my pantry, and I know exactly how many mixed vegetables, green beans, corn, and everything that I have. And I, I have enough, except carrots, which are my least favorite. So I'm not uh, breaking up because I don't have no carrots. I'll use what I got first before I spend any money. And let's see what else we got here. What is this? Those are lead quarters, and those are on sale. Those are decent. I have one pack of ground beef in the freezer already, so I just need to get a pack of chicken. So we're going to circle, not the lead quarters, but we're going to circle the legs, which are my least favorite. But protein, we're going to just circle those, and we're going to kind of look when we get there, though, because uh, I would rather have the thighs. Now, if the thighs are a decent price, I'll get the thighs instead of of the legs and we're gonna get one pack of pasta just one pack that's all we're gonna get we're gonna get one pack of the pasta okay they have some fish they got some cod for $4.99 but it don't come in a package like that um everybody different but if I have never made fish on YouTube uh I make fish because I like it I just throw it in aluminum foil and throw the vegetables in there and throw it in the oven. It's nothing fancy about it. Um, it it takes five minutes to do it. But I like to pick out my piece of fish. And um, I don't like to buy it in the packs like that. So it's really up to you. It's your personal preference. Uh, but I don't. I really don't want any fish. Okay. So they have my Roger Wood sausage. That's what I like about when Dixie and Harvey's, they have Roger Wood sausage. A lot of people don't know what you're talking about when you say Roger Wood. Okay, so also they have the orange juice here, and I love orange juice. I just don't drink it because it's not it's not really good. Um, I might get two to four ounces uh, with a meal or something like that when I have to. But right here, they're showing the Tropicana, which is quite expensive. But I will get, since this is a Winn-Dixie sale paper, Winn-Dixie and Harvey is the same. So their no-name brand is SE brand. It costs $3.99 for a gallon of orange juice. And that's what I'll do. I do it all the time. That orange juice is fine. Obviously, it's not as good as Tropicana, but okay. Ain't nothing as good as Tropicana. Okay. So we're going to have to, go, oh, look at this French bread. Am I going to make spaghetti? Yeah, but I think I'm going to get the garlic bread. French bread is good, though. Okay, so we're going to circle this bell pepper up here at the very top. And as you can see, there go our bell peppers right there for $0.79. Cent. We're going to grab. We're going to grab just one of those. And um, oh, that, oh, oh, I have to get my cucumbers. And I got to get my carrots. And one head of lettuce, which I don't see. Okay, if they had the lettuce, it'd be up here. So, I'm going to write lettuce at the top. 
of my page here. As you can see, I wrote lettuce to remind me that I have to get some lettuce. <clears throat> That's my salad for the week. And see, these cherries are ridiculous. Look at this. Can you see that? Those are our cherries, people. Four ninety nine a pound. I wouldn't be able to just just be able to just taste it. And we are going to circle this mustard. Yes, I need mustard. Shocking, isn't it? I need mustard. I always get ketchup, but I barely run out of the mustard. But we're gonna go ahead. They got my raisin brand, but I'm not gonna get any. Uh, I don't get a lot of cereal here. Oh, that go. No way. How much is that? Do that say three ninety nine? Mm -mm -mm. I'm going to circle the syrup, but obviously I'm not going to get the Hungry Jack. It costs too much. I'm looking at the price right now, but I'm going to get the no-name brand of that. And then we're going to get these Ritz crackers. We already got our tuna fish and our, let me recap right quick. We're going to use the chicken legs, but I'm going to look at the thighs when I get there. The quarters are on sale. No pork chops are on sale. And we're going to get, let me see. I'm going to circle this bleach. I know that's not food, but I, I need some more bleach. I get, I'm get. i starting to run low. And then we're going to get this Progresso soup right here instead of the Campbell's. Yeah, I'm going to get this Progresso. I'm, I'm kind of liking the Progresso soup. So we're going to circle the Progresso and... If you follow me, you know that I like Sprite uh, or 7-Up, and 7-Up is my absolute favorite, but I'll get Sprite when it's not on sale or whatever. I don't, I'm don't. i not a big soda drinker, but I like to have it for when I do want one. So they have the 7-Up. So we're going to circle the 7-Up. And that's really it. We have added lettuce up here. And that's going to do it. I go my syrup. I did circle the syrup. Okay, so that's everything that we're going to get from the store this week. And once you circle all the items that you're going to get, you take that sale paper, fold it up, and you roll out to the store, whichever store you choose, and you go specifically by your list. And that way you'll save money with your coupons when you go to the store. Yes, I'm a dinosaur. It's old-fashioned, but this is the only way I can make it. This is all I know. This is how I do it to make it each day, okay? Okay, so thanks for joining me, and hope you can save money with meal planning this week. Okay, at this time, we're going to breathe in and breathe out and get our day started. You ready? Breathe in, breathe out. We thank you, Father, for another day. We are so internally grateful, Father God. We woke up this morning. Thank you for that, Father God. We know that there are some people hungry. We know that there are some people who didn't wake up this morning. So we thank you, Father. We give you all praises. Okay? So wherever you're headed today, wherever you got to go, to work, to school, maybe you have a doctor's appointment, it doesn't matter. Be happy. Be joyful. Put a smile on your face and treat people with respect. It's the only way to live, okay? So have a good day. Have a blessed day. And remember, God loves you, and so do I. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye. Thank you guys for watching today. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Take a minute to leave a comment. I look forward to talking to you soon.